my sentiments must have fallen upon deaf ears. My hunger could not keep me away. Books and knowledge are all I have left. For all I seek, there are fragments scattered throughout this land. What can I do to help? Find the sacred place, venture down, and seek the tome that I desire. Then the knowledge will be unleashed. A knowledge that speaks of celestial powers of which we can only dream. The cosmos a beacon of understanding. Its reflection ripples on the vast pool, hinting at lost secrets. I've seen the ripples, a presence I cannot fathom. So you've met our goddess. She fell to this land and is scattered across it. Junus is buried deep below the cathedral, but it is said her spirit lives on, trying to communicate with those left behind. Pray tell me about the celestial powers you spoke of, the power in the sacred place. Many would describe a glacial weapon, one that only a small collective can wield, through an ancient ritual few know of. They can be found, of course, in the most unassuming place you could imagine, yet it is a place of custom, saved only for the noblest of peoples. Many of these ancient powers are solidified in legend, little more than tricks used to impress ignorant people. Not this one. The power is harbored in a frozen and unforgiving place. A vast stretch of water that never thaws. Its ripples created from the glow high above. A glacial glow which some believe is an echo of those ancient powers hitherto unfathomable. Concealed from sight, yet a mighty weapon. There's much we do not understand. That elevator back in the cemetery. To where does it lead? I have heard whispers of the place. As I recall, it once was a place of prestige, authority. Those who resided in the highest peaks broke through when everything was lost. Then it slowly descended, a stronghold against evil. No one has been atop those walls since. Alas, it is an enigma.
vengeance grows near. I can almost taste it. Take heed. You must be cautious in your pursuit of such power. Do you know its strength? It is a strength that belongs to me. All my own. I am the definition of such might. My heart is lightened. A receiver of a great gift. A precious one. Let me help you. No. No. It is my time. My turn. My power to manipulate as I wish. Let me help you. No. No. It is my time. My turn. My power to manipulate. As I wish.
shadow. The forbidden power overwhelms by its own unique means. One that can never be relinquished by the person, no matter their will. You do not have the right to carry such a burden. Who has that right? No one. one approaches. Come, let me take a good look at you. I sense hesitation in you. My appearance disturbs you. <laughs> I have seen horrors greater than what is before me. That I understand, for it has grown dark around these parts. The joy slowly ebbs away. There was a time when we would dance. Frolic together, in harmony. But for some, that joy would never be enough. Their pursuit of perfection and immortality snuffed out what we already held dear. We danced through days and nights, through purple flowers. A delicate, yet hardy construction, stone and wood dependent on them. A comforting crib on which to rest your head. What is this place? A ruin. Twisted and mangled into a writhing beast. The grotesque beast of corruption. But beauty dwelt here once? Indeed. I remember it more vividly than ever. And the dancing. The masked balls I organized were legendary. I can imagine it quite the occasion. The most exquisite. I can imagine it quite the occasion. The most exquisite. 